हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम डॉक्टर हिमांशु गुप्ता एंड आई हैव डन माय एमबीबीएस एंड एमडी फ्रॉम मौलाना दाद मेडिकल कॉलेज सो फॉर द पास थ्री इयर्स थ्रू माय यूट्यूब चैनल आई हैव बीन गाइडिंग स्टूडेंट्स टू हेल्प देम गेट अ गुड रैंक इन एम्स पी जी एंड नीट पी सो टुडे आई एम इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू टू डिस्कस हाउ यू कैन यूटिलाइज योर थर्ड ईयर एम वेल सो टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू फ्यू थिंग्स गाइज दैट विल गिव यू अ किक स्टार्ट इन योर करियर एंड इफ यू फॉलो दिस थिंग्स very carefully and if you watch this video till the end guys you are definitely going to benefit a lot throughout your year and throughout your career so guys do watch this video till the end and let's begin with this video guys before i begin i want to tell you few things about the third year mbbs what your friends will tell you and what the reality is your friends will tell you that third year mbbs is a honeymoon period you have to do a lot of parties you have to do a lot of extra curricular activities you have to go to a lot of trips but the reality is not this guys after your third year mbbs you have a final year waiting and for you guys you have your next exam waiting and you know what you do in the third year mbbs will decide what you become in the future if you don't study well in the third year mbbs then you struggle in the final year mbbs as well because it is not possible at all to read you know 10 subjects in just one year so you have to do a part of that uh, final year in third year itself so ye this is a big you know dhokha with us ye sab dogla pan hai in final year you have too many subjects to read and in third year you just have few subjects to read and you know people feel that in third year we just have to read the third year subjects and that is why we have a lot of time no guys this is not the reality the reality is that you have to you have to cover your final year syllabus at least once in in your third year and if you fail to do so then your struggle in the mbbs will start right so now let us discuss a strategy how you can overcome this struggle during your third year mbbs another question about which students are confused is that sir how to prepare differently for this next exam guys i will tell you that you know the exam patterns will keep on changing after every 5 years earlier you know there was a different kind of neat pg then was a clinical neat pg now your next exam is coming but you know one thing was remaining same the subjects okay they were not changing the contents of the subject they were not changing except for the newer updates the type of questions that will be asked they are also not changing right so even if the type of the questions are changing the content you know remains the same the way you have to prepare for the any exam whether it is theory exam whether it is mcq exam it will always remain the same because the content remain the same and the way you have to develop your concepts that will also remain the same so guys this is a very stupid question that how do we have to prepare separately for the next you know if you prepare your theory well you will be able to give any exam in the world you know students who do well in the neat pg exam they do well in the aims exam also they do well in the pg exam as well there are students who get a good score in us mri step 1 they do well in the neat pg exam also they do well in the aims exam also so guys you have to focus on preparing your subject well if you prepare for any exam if you you know appear for any exam you are you know definitely going to do well so guys let us now take a pen and a paper and let us just plan how we have to distribute our time throughout the year throughout the one year that we are getting so guys as i have already told you the importance will be on the final year subjects so i will tell you how you 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 can you know divide your time between the various final year subjects so medicine you know i would like to give you two months surgery also two months ops gyne one month then you have your pediatrics one month and your short subjects again one month so seven months guys we have to dedicate to reading final year subjects and the five months that we are left with we can dedicate dedicate it to reading your third year subjects now guys coming to how do we have to go about an individual subject 
so we are talking about an individual subject okay so we have we need to have three resources one is your online q bank and videos the second is your standard textbook and the third is your notes so we have to have these three resources if we have to prepare for any subject okay so sir from which question bank or uh, videos we should go for okay you can go for any question bank or videos that your senior is asking you to go for okay because you know every every institute is doing a lot of hard work and we are not good enough we are not good enough to judge any institute but still if you guys are confused i would tell you that most of the students most of the students okay more than 80% per of the students they go for marrow and even you know the teachers like your rakesh nayar sir abbas ali sir rohan kandelwal sir they are all one of the top faculties in india uh, for your neat pg exam so uh, you can uh, go for it right then guys you don't have to waste too much time the only thing that will matter is don't waste another 6 months thinking about which plan i should go for which institute i should go for these are not so many costly plans if you are confused you know buy everything that is available in the market theek hai but don't waste too much time just thinking which is good right so now guys how you have to utilize any uh, online video or uh, q bank right how you have to prepare one subject right so if you are preparing some medicine okay like your uh, you can first start watching videos of your rakesh nayar sir he is going to give you a lot of time in the medicine okay approximately 200 hours okay so you have to spend a lot of time 3 to 4 hours daily have to be spent on watching your videos on watching your videos and if you watch these videos on 2x you can save a lot of time as well theek hai so watch your videos on 2x or 1.5x theek hai and what will happen if you are just dedicating 3 to 4 hours daily to just reading your videos or watching your videos that will guys help you to read your standard textbooks very fast that will help you to understand your notes very well that is the whole point of watching the videos right of watching the video lectures before so 3 to 4 hours daily should be dedicated to watching videos and 3 to 4 hours should be dedicated to reading your standard textbook and you know accordingly we will divide the two months as well so if we have 5 minutes to read we will divide the time equally okay 12 to 15 days for each unit so we will divide the time for cardiovascular gi resp rheumat and your renal system right so we can divide the time equally if you feel that uh, one unit is having a lot of videos a lot of content then accordingly you can increase the time for that particular unit right so watch the videos okay along with the videos just open your notes so sometimes few things are not given in the notes so try to add few things if you are one of those person who likes to make all of the notes okay then it's a very good thing but i was not that kind of a person i always used to add things uh, to uh, to the uh, handwritten notes that are available in the market theek okay? hai so you can either add the those points or you can make your own notes both of the things are very good okay depending upon what is comf comfortable to you while you are reading your subject then guys after that what you can do after watching the videos okay the topics which you have read which you have watched from the videos the same topics you can try to read from the standard textbooks you don't have to read your standard textbook page by page okay just be selective and how you can be selective you can be selective by just going through the topics that you have just read in your notes the same topics can be read so you know this will help in two ways once it will help you build up concepts concepts the second it will help you uh, do the things consecutively you know once you are reading your videos then your notes then your standard textbooks so this way you are reading the same topic three times 
ठीक है दैट इज दी मेन एडवांटेज सो दिस इज हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू प्रोसीड फॉर एवरी सब्जेक्ट एंड एवरी टॉपिक एंड एट लास्ट गाइज आई ऑल्सो वॉन्ट टू टेल यू वन मोर थिंग दैट इज रिवाइजिंग योर सब्जेक्ट रिवाइजिंग योर सब्जेक्ट ओके सो गाइज सम ऑफ द टाइम ओके सो वंस यू आर डन लाइक यू हैव डेडिकेटेड टू मंथ्स टू योर मेडिसिन सो आफ्टर दैट वॉट यू कैन डू यू कैन ओपन अप योर मैरो क्यू बैंक ओके यू कैन ओपन अप योर मैरो क्यू बैंक एंड यू कैन स्टार्ट सॉल्विंग द क्वेश्चन सो द एम ऑफ डूइंग द क्वेश्चन एट दिस टाइम इज नॉट इज नॉट यू नो बींग प्रिपेयर फॉर दिस नेक्स्ट एग्जाम बट द मेन एम विल बी दैट यू रिमेन इन टच विद द टॉपिक्स दैट यू हैव रेड वन मंथ और टू मंथ बैक ओके इफ यू आर कम्फर्टेबल विद रीडिंग योर नोट्स अगेन ओके देन इट इज गुड बट रिवाइजिंग योर सब्जेक्ट्स इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज वॉट हैपन्स विद मेनी स्टूडेंट्स यू नो दे विल रीड द फाइनल ईयर वंस थ्रू आउट द थर्ड ईयर बट वेन दे लैंड अप इन द फाइनल ईयर दे दे डोंट हैव अ सिंगल आइडिया अबाउट एनी सब्जेक्ट so i don't want you guys to land in that in that problem so i want you guys that you take out some time you know after one month or two months to half an hour daily that i advise for the neat pg aspirants also that you take out some time for revision in the form of question bank in the form of just seeing your notes again and notes should be such that you have prepared from the videos you have prepared from the standard textbook you know dedicate half an hour or one hour daily to revising few things and what will happen guys you know after uh, one year guys these subjects will not be new to you okay and you know your your mbbs will go so smooth your next exam will so so uh, go so smooth that uh, you know you will enjoy you will enjoy and if you just balance your time with your studies then guys you will you know you will uh, you know feel like you will enjoy when you go to trips you will enjoy when you go home with a gold medal okay so you know when i go to uh, some party when i go to uh, when i hang out with my friends i enjoy these things only when i worked throughout the day if i'm just you know wasting my time every day then i don't even enjoy enjoying okay then i don't even enjoy going to parties so if you if you will just work hard throughout the year and after that you plan a trip with your friends to some place and after that you you plan a party okay then you will enjoy that party because you have earned that party but if you're just you know wasting your time wasting your money okay then you know the parties and the enjoyments they will all become a very normal thing for you ठीक है सो गाइज माई ओनली हमल रिक्वेस्ट टू यू गाइज इज दैट डेडिकेट सम टाइम टू योर फाइनल ईयर सब्जेक्ट्स डोंट वेस्ट टाइम थिंकिंग अबाउट विच प्लान्स टू गो फॉर ओके एंड यू नो वर्क हार्ड ड्रीम बिग एंड मेक योर फ्रेंड्स एंड योर फैमिली प्राउड सो टिल देन गाइज बाय टेक केयर एंड ऑल द बेस्ट एंड मीट यू इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो